December 17, 2021. I'm Jeremy Crosby. Hope you had a wonderful day. Glad you're tuning in with us this evening for Talking Fitchbury. We got a jam packed show for you all this week. We've been busy, 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 and uh, we've got some great stuff coming up. We'll check in with the Better Business Bureau on holiday exchanges. Definitely uh, want to know how you can return things, exchange things, uh, and you really want to think of that ahead of time before uh, buying friends. And so if you're a last minute shopper um, or you're just uh, concerned about doing that uh, exchanges, we'll have some uh, information for you there. Plus we'll check in with Kimberly at the Fitchburg Star. She'll have our council update uh, coming up as uh, we close out the year. But first let's start with some headlines and the holiday light tour. It's finally here. Well, Saturday, but it's close enough. It's this Saturday, tomorrow, 6 to 9 p.m. Head on out, join your friends and family and uh, your neighbors as you uh, tour around Fitchburg and check out all the great lights that will be twinkling. And we have the map. Andrew, roll it. There it is, the map. It's officially out there. You can check this out uh, online. We have that posted uh, online at uh, on Facebook and at the city's website, so you can uh, go on. And uh, as mentioned, Holly, uh, Holly Shock, uh, it's Holly Hawk. I almost said Holly Shock. Holly Hawk Street. That's the street. That's one of many that are, uh, it's like they're all teamed up. 2763, 2762, 58, 54, 55, 47. They're all like right, yeah, it's going to be pretty cool. Uh, but either way, we'll uh, see you out there 6 to 9 p.m. tomorrow night. Remember that each uh, house that is part of the map here will have a sign in front of it. And you should vote for your favorite holiday display that will be uh, available uh, after uh, the weekend for you to vote. The winner, by the way, receives a nice gift basket gift basket from local businesses. All right, turn your attention to the Better Business Bureau. On a reminder, don't share your COVID-19 vaccine card on social media. That's right. Now that COVID-19 vaccination recommendations for pediatric and teen populations have been extended and those restrictions continue to be lifted and changed and it rolls out to more individuals around the country, BBB reminds people not to share your vaccination card on social media. Remember, even a minimal amount of self-identifying information makes you more vulnerable to identity theft and can help scammers create phony versions of the card. There have even been reports of scammers offering fake vaccine cards for sale. We've heard of these stories uh, throughout the nation. Share your vaccine sticker on your profile frame instead. If you want to post about your vaccine, there is a safer way to do it. You can share a photo of your vaccination sticker or set a frame around your profile picture. There's lots of ways of doing it. You could just say, I got back to you. I don't know. That would just be the easy way. Review your security settings too. Check your security settings on social media platforms to uh, see what you are sharing and uh, with whom. If you are only want to share with your friends and family on post, be sure that that is set in your privacy settings um, and or configured uh, to that. Be wary of answering uh, popular social media prompts. Sharing your vaccine photo is just the latest social trend. Think twice before participating. I think you should think twice before posting uh, anything, especially when it comes to uh, personal information. Uh, that is not a good idea as uh, people can pick up on those things. And you might even uh, not even think about it, but it said at the bottom there, those kind of come out as passwords of common things that you have in your, your family. So, you know. If you talk about grilling a lot, you might have grilling in your password. I don't know. I'm just theoretically saying that. That's Andrew's password. Grill95. <laughs> Check it out. For more information or further inquiries, it's not. Contact uh, the Wisconsin Better Business Bureau at www.bbb.org, Wisconsin. You got the number on your screen, and uh, you can always find out more information on the latest scams and trends. And if BBB is sharing this, that means that it's out there and people are doing it and people are getting scammed. So you need to think twice before you post. All right, that does it for our headlines. Coming up next, we're going to open up our guest segment. We're going to be talking uh, with our friends at BBB about making those returns and exchanges. But first, starting now through the holidays, we had a chance to uh, film some of the Fitchburg singers singing your favorite holiday classics. And we're going to go to the break with one of those songs. Listen up. Listen up. 